just want to get your reaction to the sting, the undercover uh, expose by the anti-Brexit group led by Donkeys. Matt Hancock, Kwasi Kwarteng, among other MPs, saying that they would work for a fictional company for £10,000 a day. It's within the rules. Does that mean we should care about the rules? No, I think it's important that, uh, uh, first of all, that we make sure that every MP operates in a way which is transparent. So when members of parliament do do work uh, which complements the work that they do in the House of Commons, then it's absolutely vital that we know who's paying them, what they earn, and that's what the, the register is there for. I think it's also appropriate as well that the Parliamentary uh, Standards Commissioner has the opportunity to investigate and to look at any activity that may uh, cross the line. Uh, on this occasion, uh, I think it's pretty clear that things that uh, were offered and things that were considered were within the rules. But inevitably, uh, all of us will uh, reflect on this and think the, the uh, first duty of a Member of Parliament is towards their constituents. And ultimately, uh, the really important thing is, is an MP delivering for their constituents? Is a Member of Parliament doing everything they can to put public service first? Is the other issue that they didn't seem to do much due diligence on this company, did they, given that it was non-existent? Well, again, uh, you know, the, the, the individuals concerned will have to answer for themselves. Uh, it is the case that there are members of parliament who do work for um, a variety of organisations that complements what they do. So, for example, Maria Caulfield, health minister, also works as a nurse. Dan Poulter, previously a health minister, works as a doctor. So it is possible to combine additional activity with your responsibility towards your constituents, but each individual MP must judge for themselves. Is what they're doing something that they can defend? Are they making sure it's transparent and within the rules? But above all, is it the case that they're putting their constituents first? Okay.